Okay, my son loves to use this, so I'm going to go real quick before he comes and steals it from me, okay? So I'm just gonna take this, I open it, put it in there, release it, and turn. Lovely. Okay, let's see if I can get a few more before he gets here. Steals all my fun is what he does, and this really, this is so cool. See, I used to have to use a knife for this. And when I did, of course, then you are, you're worrying about, you like, you know, are you gonna end up cutting your thumb around the way? Oh, here he comes. Hi, honey. Okay, the funny is those dogs going like crazy behind us. Oh, beautiful. No, if you want to show anything, you show the beautiful cut in the fruit. How easy that was and how clean it was. You know, for people who do, I bet, um, like fancy fruit things, it, it, this nice clean hole would be filled beautifully. Fill it with sugar and stick a fork in it. <laughs> That's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> I usually use the, uh, the spiraler that I have since you were a kid. That's what I've used. But this, I've never used these before and I see them all the time. So I want to see, oh my gosh. I remember when we went to Trey's wedding, you know, the one that you didn't get to go to mm -hmm. up in the mountains. Uh, and remember I told you about the caramel apples they had? Mm -hmm. They caramelized the apple and we should try this actually. Go ahead and get your strawberries. They caramelized the apple, and then what they had done was they simply went straight down with what must have been something very similar to this, just went straight down, and they didn't go all the way. They stopped right there. So that when we took our caramel apple, mm, let me do this. When we took our caramel apple, we just, instead of having to bite into it and make a horrible mess, we just did slice by slice of caramel apple. And I just, I thought that was ingenious. Oh my God, so that's what we're gonna do with this. Let's make caramel apples. And then you can have a slice of caramel apple each time. Awesome, yay, we're doing it. But in the meantime, I know we're gonna love this because of the caramel apple effect, because of what we had seen when we went to Red River, New Mexico for the wedding. Um, as far as normal apples, of course, if you wanna be boring, yeah, you can just cut up a normal apple, yay. sure. Oh, you mean like you're doing? <laughs> yes. Well, next time it's going to be caramelized.